And in the United States, President Joe Biden is singing the praise of his government over the achievement of nearly 190,000 jobs created in August. Mr. Biden says it is one of the strongest job-creating periods in history. President Biden also says his administration has achieved 13.5 million jobs since inception. He adds that inflation lowered to close to its former rate before the pandemic. Mr. Biden voiced his disagreement with economic experts who said the country needed higher unemployment and lower wages to fix the nation's economic challenges. As we head into Labor Day, we ought to take a step back and take note of the fact that America is now one of the strongest job-creating periods in our history, in the history of our country. And it wasn't that long ago that America was losing jobs. In fact, my predecessor was one of only two presidents in history who entered his presidency and left with fewer jobs than when he entered. Look, look at where we are now. Just this morning, we learned that the economy created 190,000 jobs last month. All told, we've added 13.5 million jobs since I took office. And two members of the far-right Proud Boys group have been jailed for leading the U.S. Capitol riot. 46 years old Dominic Pezzola, who was convicted of assaulting police and obstructing an official proceeding, was sentenced to 10 years in prison. Ethan Nodin, 32, who led the group's march on Congress on the 6th of January 2021, was sentenced to 18 years for a more serious seditious conspiracy charge before being sentenced. Nordian told the court, and I quote, I would like to apologize for my lack of leadership that day. He called the riot a complete and utter tragedy. The leader of the Old Keepers Militia, Stuart Rhodes, was also given 18 years in prison earlier this year. And still in the United States, the Blendon Township Police Department has released body camera video that shows the events leading to the fatal shooting of a pregnant woman. 21 years old Takia Young died last week in Blendon Township after being shot in the parking lot of the grocery store. Unborn daughter did not survive. An employee after the store told of officers who were at the store on an unrelated matter that multiple people were fleeing the store with stolen items, which included Miss Young, who had allegedly taken multiple bottles of alcohol. The body camera video shows one of two officers walking to the driver's side of the vehicle Young was in. The other officer was seen walking in front of the vehicle. The, of the officers are heard telling Young to get out of the car multiple times. Young was heard responding to the officers, saying, For what? One of the officers replied, They said you stole stuff. Do not leave. She replied that she didn't steal anything. Other girls were taking them. We're asking for the city to do better, even when it comes to the, how long it took to get the video out. They promised that family the video earlier in the week, you know, and then it took them all the way until Friday to showcase that video. That's ridiculous.